It's amazing what can happen when you bring together the expertise of two major names in automotive networking. And when those names are K2L and Microchip, you get the new Automotive Connectivity Demo. This demo, created by K2L and featuring microchip products and development boards, is designed to help you to explore the full potential of next-generation automotive networking. At the heart of the demo is K2L's Automotive Test System, or ATS. This combines the ATS test software running on a PC with an Optalizer Mocha Compact all-in-one multibus hardware interface, which is connected to several of Microchip's evaluation or demo boards. The Optalizer Mocha Compact connects to the sensors on the demo over two CAN interfaces. One CAN interface connects to a 3D gesture recognition board based on Microchip's Jest IC technology. The other connects to a starter kit for CAN LIN networking, which is based on Microchip's DSPIC 33 EV digital signal controller. The ATS system communicates with the actuators of the demo over one MOST and four LIN connections. The actuators are an LED ring, a motor control application and a coax-based MOST 150 audio connection, but more about these later. The automotive test system simplifies and improves the testing and simulation of distributed systems in automotive applications. It features the full version of the Optalizer Mocha Compact Hardware Interface with its unique mix of bus interfaces. There are a total of 14 interfaces. 6 high-speed or low-speed CAN, 6 LIN, a single-wire CAN and a MOST interface. Plus, there are also two audio interfaces, trigger interfaces, relays and so much more. A standard USB 2 port connects the ATS to the PC running the test software. The viewer component of the ATS software allows you to see the messages and signals between all of the connected interfaces and there's also a message generator for sending and receiving messages on these buses. You can use the ATS for running simulations of a complete device or parts of it or even for running complete rest bus simulations. The code generator automatically generates .NET code from protocol descriptions such as a CANDB database for CAN, an LDF file for LIN and an XML function catalogue for most networks. In fact, ATS is so quick and easy that it only took a few days to develop the HMI software you'll see in this demo. So, let's get down to details, starting with the components. First, we have Microchip's Hillstar Jest IC development kit for 3D gesture recognition, which will be used as the control unit. In this demo, we're using just four of the kit's 20 different gestures. So, we have a swipe to left or to the right, as well as air wheels in both directions. The signals, which are typically sent over the sensor's I2C interface, go straight into a special DSPIC 33 based board, where they are converted to CAN. This is also where the Optalizer Mocha Compact is connected. A DSPIC 33 EV CAN LIN starter kit is connected to the ATS via CAN, and two temperature signals are reported to the HMI via that path one from the DS pick board and one from a hall sensor mounted on the motor here. The hall sensor is connected to the DS pick 33 board via a scent interface and reports the temperature as well as the location of the BLDC motor. Now let's look at the actuators. Here we have three LIN buses going into an LED application which has 36 individual PCBs. Each PCB is populated with an LED and a PIC16F1829 LIN 8-bit microcontroller with an integrated voltage regulator and LIN transceiver. Each of these PCBs represents a single LIN node. 
There are 16 LEDs on each of the two LIN buses and four more LEDs on a third LIN bus in the middle of the ring. The changing colour of the LEDs indicates the mode in which the demo is running. The Optimizer Mocker with its LIN Master Mode and the ATS software application can address each node separately and send commands to adjust the colour and brightness of the LEDs. On the other side of the demo, we have the Motor Control application. This is a microchip MCP8025 brushless DC motor driver evaluation board controlled via single LIN interface. The software sends commands to the board which set the speed and direction of the motor. Last but not least, we have a most 150 point-to-point -point connection over coax from the optimizer to an amplifier board. Music from the MP3 player goes into the optimizer and is forwarded over the most 150 coax to the amplifier and its connected loudspeakers. The volume of the music is controlled with air wheels on the JestIC 3D gesture recognition sensor. An air wheel in one direction makes the volume louder and an air wheel in the other direction turns the volume down. Notice how the LED ring acts like an equaliser to show peaks in the volume. The gesture recognition sensor also allows you to switch the demo from most audio data transmission to one of its other two modes. A swipe takes you to the motor control demo. Here, the air wheels control the speed and direction in which the motor is spinning. The signals created by the gestures on the CAN bus are interpreted through the ATS application software and the corresponding LIN commands are sent to the MCP8025 motor control board. The hall sensor measures the motor speed and direction and transmits the signals via scent to the DSPIC 33 EV CAN LIN starter kit. This translates the signals into CAN messages, which are then transmitted to the ATS. Notice how, in this mode, the LED ring is used to show the speed and direction of the motor. Another swipe brings us to the temperature mode. Here, there are two temperature curves, which represent the temperatures measured by the sensors on the DSPIC 33 board and the hall sensor. If a finger is placed onto the sensor, you see how this changes one of the curves on the monitor. Adding an offset temperature makes an even bigger impact on the curve. In this mode, the colour of the LEDs changes to reflect the fall and the rise of the temperature. So, there you have it, K2L's Automotive Connectivity Demo. A combination of K2L's automotive test system and optimizer hardware interface with microchips application development boards for motor control, temperature sensing, 3D gesture recognition and audio over most 150. To experience the demo for yourself or to learn more about next generation automotive networking, visit the website today. Thank you.